Hey Dan, I've been worried recently, you know. Age, getting old and stuff, you know. It must be said, Stan, that there are those that think you are getting a little bit long in the tooth. Well, look at you. Look at you. Yeah, no, but I still got, you know, I still hold and retain that George Clooney-esque kind of thing. You reckon? Well, that's what I've been told by my, my mom. Blind people. <laughs> Stevie Wonder. Hey! Who the hell is that? Oh, it's Ozzy. Come here. How many times did I ask you to come and join us on the show? First time, you get, you, go, you get all excited. Second time, you go, I wonder if we get in. Third time, you go, they ain't never going to get us in. Fourth time, I just went, fuck off. Ah, but don't forget, after a bit of a discussion, we sorted it all out. Now you're the knobs, man. You're twiddling knobs, make it sound good. I'm, I'm going to be put. I don't know what to push and pr buttons to press. Ozzy, I'm sure you'll be fine, but listen, I've got a television show to do here, so if you don't mind... TV is a completely different animal to what I'm used to, rock and roll. I know it is, but this is in high definition, it's got lots of... High definition? I only got three buttons, that's right up my alley. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't work the fucking thing. Anyway, I must move on with the story. Dan, listen. I'm getting a bit concerned about age. Okay, yeah. And, uh, you know, it, it, uh, so I went to the doctors, you know, again. Well, more of, a, more of a specialist, like, you know. Botox? No, no, no. I decided to go for a facelift. Oh. Can you not tell? <laughs> what, that you've had a facelift? Yes. Oh, now I can see it. Of course, Dan. Look, I can... <laughs> You're talking shite. Anyway, I went for a facelift because of my birthday and stuff, you know, and I thought, oh, I need to treat myself. So what I did was, I went and spent five thousand pounds. So you spent five thousand pounds on a facelift. Actually, actually, I've got to say, when I left the, the the surgeons, you know, when they eventually released us, like you know, and I was like good enough to go into the public, you know, not frightening the kids and stuff. <laughs> so when I went out, what I did was I went past the uh, newsstand and I bought a newspaper and I thought, oh, I'll just ask this lad a question quickly. I said, I hope you don't mind us asking, but. Uh, how old do you think I am? Uh-oh. That's a dangerous question to ask sometimes, you know. I know it is, but I, was, I just wanted to see, you know, see what... Okay, yeah, yeah. And what did he say? So he said, oh, you look about 35. I said, oh, thanks very much. I'm actually 47. And I felt really good. So I carried on walking. And I, and I was a bit hungry, so I went to McDonald's, you know. Okay. And I thought, I'll just ask someone else. So I asked the, I asked the chick behind the counter. <laughs> she said, oh, I hope you don't think I'm being uh, rude or anything, but can you just, uh, you know, could you tell us how old I am? She says, oh, I think you look about uh, 29, said this young chick. I'm so very happy with that. I says, well, actually, I'm 47, you know. <laughs> oh, you look really well, she says. <laughs> anyway, so later on, I'm, I'm walking home, and I passed, and I'm standing at the bus stop, because my car was knackered, you know. <laughs> so I'm standing at the bus stop, and then there was this old woman s sitting at the bus stop, and I thought, uh -oh. I'll ask her the same question. Okay. Why not? You know, why not? I'm just getting a bit of reassurance all the way down the line. So I says, Excuse me, madam. Madam, well, you know, old bint. But I says, you, she says, I says, uh, can I ask you a question? How old do you think I look? And she said to us, she says, listen, I'm 85 years old and my eyesight's gone. But when I was young, there was a sure way of telling a man's age. Okay. That's, honestly, that's what she said. I says, I says, oh, I am. What's that then? She says, I put my hand down your pants <laughs> and I play with your balls for 10 minutes. <laughs> And I'll be able to tell you your exact age. <laughs> okay, this is quite hard to believe. Well, well, that's the thing, isn't it? That's the thing. <laughs> you know, it was in there, she was mulling around, she's oh, no. kicking around, she's doing the sister, and whoa, she's doing this thing. Wasn't too bad, actually, I have to say. <laughs> so, because there was no one around, you know, I let her do it as, 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 as she should. Like, you know, she's 85. Come on, respect that for the elders and that. Okay. You know. Anyway, 10 minutes later, this old lady, she says to us, okay, it's done. You're 47. <laughs> I was stunned. I says, hey, by the way, man, that's brilliant. How did you do that? She says, uh, I was standing behind you in McDonald's, you stupid bastard. <laughs> Ready! Ready.